Hey guys, Tibic here, and welcome to episode 35 of Crusader Kings. And in the past one, we... I can't remember. We broke free, I think. Yeah, we did. And we are now independent. What was that the episode before? I can't quite remember, it's been a few days. But, um... We are currently down in Poland. And we are fighting to stop... Uh, this prince from taking uh, from taking no wait we are we are yeah we have joined the dispute succession it's not I'm just doing a little bit of war score here hoping to gain some alliances in the future because having alliances is good we can also press claim on Sweden if I can just find I go yeah, we can press claim against this guy. Well, we are... We have raised army levies now, so we can't actually. But we can, in theory, press war against Sweden to take... Bornholm and Halland. Which we might. A plot where she seeks to kill... Wait, Sire? Isn't that? Isn't that one of my sons? Yes. You stop that plot. Thank you. Where's my council doing? He's researching. Obviously misdirected. Yes. They don't like me so much because I'm keeping their vassals, well, their levies raised, and uh, that's all right. They'll just have to deal with it. Sweden has some rebels out here. That's uh, not a problem for me. They can have that. How are these sieges going? We can probably just raise this one now, but. The bishopry might actually be something we can just rush. This one we can't, we'll just get totally mangled. What I'm worried about is my... Um, no, the ducal claims will stay even if I die, but I'm getting very, very old. Perfect, we have now contributed a few more points here. 14% war score, and it's a total of 6. Lost in the battles, but... Yeah, let's just rush this bishopry. Ow. That was painful. That's gonna cost me some money. I can afford it. I have plenty. How's this going? They're doing good. Tempted to raise another military band here, but... Are they getting more troops somewhere? No, just these guys. They can go there and merge. Actually, go to the other levy there. Um, I can raise some vassal levies, but I don't know where we get these. It's a 1206. Good. Yeah, these guys can stand down. But these guys can go join. And we are building some garrisons around the area. So now we're all up to fort level 3 on our trade posts, which is good. And now we're gonna focus on getting them up to 3-3. So this one is not part of a big, but this one is. So let's increase the merchant port on that one. And um, hold on. This one needs to get to a merchant port as well. One child lacks a guardian. My grandson needs someone. Let's see, who can we make like us more? Hmm. The Merigdansk. Yeah. Or this bishop. He's craven but cruel. Okay. Sure. Let's do that. merge these guys and it's time to sack this holding. Ow. 
We lost almost a thousand men on that fight. But now we can start hunting. Let's go hunting for Polish troops here. 31. We'll soon win against the king. Um, the prince, bishop, break. That's part of what? That's part of Poland. Wow, it's expensive. Lose some prestige. I'm using it. We are going to have a lack of fun now. And uh, if I had any military mercenaries, I don't think I have any. <laughs> nope. I would go... I would lose a lot there. Yep, five-year loan at 25% interest, which means that I pay a little bit more money in a while. It's not a good thing to do these loans. But it works. Uh, we are allied, but I do have a claim there. Okay. My kinsman is now a tough soldier. He's gonna lead some troops, I think. Martial skill three, that's not bad, actually. Um, can I do anything on this? No, not while we are sieging. This one's going good. So I need to keep my monthly balance over 300 now, just to be sure. And if you guys see me spending money to bring it below that, would you smack me on the fingers or something? Or just shout at me? There we go. It's that one, and we only have 500 men left in the bishopry. Let's take them out. It's costly, but... We'll get a lot of the war score. Yeah, nice. Um... That one next. Join. Actually, we go to this one for Chesnin and. Uh, ah. Not even gonna try pronouncing Jablusko Os. I don't know. Sorry. You can also go and. This is the Holy Roman. We don't want that. But this is. Our ally. <laughs> go for that one. My vassal has contracted consumption, which is not a good thing. It's pretty much a guaranteed way to die. And money is going up again. That's thanks to the military levies being all the mercenaries. The retinues is the word I'm looking for. Are looking good. Oh, we can get another retinue. We should get a Baltic warrior. Heavy infantry. Oh, yeah. Let's do that. We can afford it. Large merchant post. Bornholm and Skåne. Perfect. So now this trade zone value is even higher. And uh, we should be earning more money from all of these. I can't actually request that this war ends. That's part of this guy's options, I suppose. They have two baronies here. Well, one castle capital and one barony. And a town. A lot of men. I would like to hold a few of these just for the levies. My son-in-law died. That's all right, I suppose. Let's uh, see. I'll... I'll let my son tutor him. We are well ahead of these guys. Can I 
plot to kill him. And you as well. A lot of people who want to see him dead. That would also give me back some of my money. Because just looking at this plot here, we will be able to take him out. I think 150% is pretty much a guaranteed kill. That's all. And if he's passing away, we can just take out half the campaign fund. Because his son, this guy, is the heir, and he has not, he's not old, and he's got very little prestige. That's good. Very good indeed. How's the siege just going? Okay, take that down. Ouch. So we are making money, but due to the um, due to the retinues being reinforced, it does take a little bit longer. Ooh, that's a big army. Where are you going? I'm going to crack up. Um, is there a river crossing? Nope. I would have wanted that because. He's going. Oh, he's going down there. We should help him. Ow! What fort level? Oh, that was dumb. I just lost half my levy. Ah, uh, we have 800 troops left. That was very stupid of me. That's gonna take forever to re uh, to recover. And I'm leading that army. Yeah, probably not the best idea, considering that I'm this old. January 1st, 1208. And we're crossing, but... Good. And you can go... Oh, nice, more money. Now we can actually spend a little bit. Uh, this one year. Get merchant port. And this one should... I want to make a merchant port. I can do that. I'll get the money back. I was thinking disbanding these guys. So I don't have any raised levies now, which is good. Approve of the plan. Take out that guy now. There's also a patrician. Yeah, that's correct. Failure. Okay, but they don't know it's me yet. <laughs> I say yet because they will figure out. Um, how's the military looking? We can raise 3,000 men. Okay. You guys meet up there and you guys meet up there. How many ships? Actually, I don't want any realm levies. Just uh, get the ships. And some ships. Having ships up costs a fortune. 
merge and embar. And we'll go down to Gdansk. You guys can merge and embark and head down to Gdansk as well. And this is a friendly port, so disband and merge and get going. I don't want me to be leading any troops. You there. You can. He's my kinsman, that's alright. This one is led by, I don't know, it's led by this guy. So I will be, if I kill that guy off, I will lose a uh, marshal, but I do have a lot more better marshals out there. Pretty sure I do. All right. I think we'll succeed with this. Question is, do I still have the claim? We are allies in this war, so if I die, I will not get the claim. Which will basically be a waste of money trying to get that. Oh well. Look at the fort devils of these. Wow. The garrisons. Okay. We lost a mare. Good. Just the small barony left. Only 600 men. So once we're down halfway through, I'll take it down. It's a very big Swedish army. Actually, Sweden is in a bit of mess right now. He's rebelling. War for claiming Sweden. How many can he raise right now? He can raise 8,000 troops, so I'd need a pretty good war chest to be able to steal territory from Sweden. I wish I could press ducal claim on both. We are also in a truce. No, we're not. Or are we? We are committed then. Yeah, we are truced until... T well, four more years. And we can start stealing territory. In that time, we should be able to build up a good war chest. This one here should have a merchant port. There we go. Um, good but bad. Well, they're not gonna like me now. How are they actually liking me? Well, they're loving me. <laughs> okay. Let's uh, see. Yep. Take it. Perfect. By the orders of Viva, I'm not... Okay. Why don't we get any kind of ransom from these guys? It's not even pocket money. Oh, and... The Grand Mayor Faster the second rest in the arms of the Lord at age 66. Died a natural death. Long live. Okay, so... Hold on now. I should nominate someone for... The Kingdom of Denmark. I'd like to nominate one of my guys. I think I'll go for this guy. He's a genius.
Yeah, how can I... Oh, since I'm part here, which is part of the Tudor Kingdom of Denmark. Okay, we need a new Chancellor. Not a good one, unfortunately. Keep fabricating claims on... Well, I didn't keep that, did I? No. Okay, well, that'll be alright. That war ended. Uh, just one moment, guys. Alright, where was I? Well, let's see. Since my guy died, I need to get another heir. It's gonna be this guy, Berold. But for now, we're gonna keep this guy since he's next in line. And he's got a fairly decent amount of respect, actually. That's not too bad. Anyhow, the siege continues. I have a couple of children lacking guardians. Mm, my sons. Let's, uh. Yeah, I want to pass these traits on. Definitely. Although, brave and ambitious. An ambitious son. No, that could be alright. I need to pick an ambition. What do I want as my ambition? Improve intrigue. Yeah, sure, I can do that. Since my intrigue is low. Otherwise, it's pretty good. <laughs> Look at these stats. They're pretty good. We're also pretty rich right now. Um, I could... Spend some of the money on my house. Actually, going to do that. If I start with uh, catacombs, upgrade to dungeon complex gives me martial skill. Uh, this one, palace gardens, more prestige. That's up here, so I'm gonna take my steward to oversee construction. Still making money. Marienburg. Okay. And I did not inherit this claim. Although, this guy here... The Pope will not accept. Okay. Okay. Uh, I will want to send this guy once I can in August. I'll send him on. Brilliant strategist, and look at his stats. Holy warrior! Wow. 22 martial skill. I'm sorry, but my son needs to be martial. Train troops in Zemgal. Or Zemgali. Some Galis or Tengali, I don't know. And this war has ended, so I should probably get my troops back home. Uh, these guys are levies. Nope. Just walk back home. Uh, Baska is rank 5. Riga needs to get a city gatehouse. And uh, maybe a toll booth. Oh, we need better town infrastructure for that. Let's get the gatehouse. Definitely. It's cheap. This castle here needs. I don't know. A castle keep incre increases the garrison and the levy. This keep here needs... Hmm... Stonewall. Increase the fort level. He's aiming for the stars, and he's ambitious. Perfect. He's got pretty good intrigue stats. Already. I should be worried. Um, this one needs... Uh, Wire lists, small stable, 
And we can go with the increased garrison just to make sure that we have a decent protection against sieges. Uh, same with this one. Actually, no. Moat. We need that. And Voska, you need to be improved as well. Stone walls. Okay. So, do we have any claims? We have on Sorrento. Hmm. Actually, what is held by Pisa? Wow. How many troops can he raise? 9,000 men. Not going to do that. That would be a very bad thing. Um, my son here needs a proper guardian. I'm sorry, I can find someone better for him. Like, for instance, my other son can teach my son. Yeah, that'll work. Alright, so Sweden. Um, we do have raised army levies, so... 6,000 troops here now. And hello Sweden, can we have war? Can't press all claims. County claim. What? We don't have that? I want this barony. It's uh, another castle, too. Yeah. How's it looking with the Swedish army right now? Can raise 22,000 men. Mm, we're gonna wait until something goes bad in Sweden, like war or something, because I cannot muster 22,000 men. That's just. Oh, it's 1210. Actually, I can raise 11,000 men. That's not bad for this little thing. I can't get more retinue. Um, I'll need to build up more trade posts and improve them. And we start finishing these guys, that's good. Um, how about no? You'd not take that. I was thinking, all this land is still... Can we somehow get warring against these guys? I need a valid Caspella, but... You should go here. How can I get a claim on something right now? I do need a claim on this place here, so... Go fabricate claims with that. Because I want to take back Dorput, which is part of Denmark. Do we have... We have an embargo against them. That's not gonna work. Hmm... Yeah, since that's part... I can't go up against these guys. Hmm. Kinda sucks. But, yeah. I'm gonna let these guys... Hmm, why? Oh. Perfect. We have a very good army there. 6,000 standing men, and that's... Actually not bad at all. I suppose I keep building up my trade posts. Um, let's go for this. I want to max them out as much as possible. I can go for this one as well. Alright, I think we're nearing the end of this episode. Um, we've been worrying. Poland 
And we... Oh. No, 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 no. Talk about being diligent. What did you get? None of them. Or was it that guy? This was going to be... I'm going to designate this one as my heir. I will not get... The Republic if I do that. But hopefully I will live for a couple more years at least. And you need to get married. Princess of the Holy Roman Empire. Would not get an alliance. Hmm. By rank. A countess here, but that's down in uh, Bohemia. No, not stats that I want to pass down the line. Attractive. That's one we want. Or quick. Oh, hungry. Kind, honest, gregarious, patient, brave. Uh, yeah. It's gonna cost me 200, but... Beryl would gain 15 prestige from marrying and 200 for marrying the relative of Duke. Yes. Yes, indeed. Uh, this will only be a betrothal, I think. Marshal Krillin, proud to get some... And she's going to be in March 95, so in a couple of months, it will be a marriage. That's good. Where are we losing money right now? We don't, actually. We have only the family dues, which is why we are earning a lot of money. Anyhow, guys, I'm going to round this episode off. Hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.